All right, so this is the tactical insulated tarp system. Will's obviously uh, doing a wonderful job of modeling it for us. So the tactical insulated tarp system, something we've designed uh, in conjunction with OM. So OM also uh, made the barrage jacket, which you'll see in one of our other videos. Why did we create this? So the reason for creating this is a, basically when you're going into a stop shot or you just need to get some insulation pieces on quickly, this has been designed for the Arctic environment, hence why we've got the uh, internal white sort of fabric on it. It's made of incredibly high level insulation. So the same type of insulation that you see in the on barrage jacket, so Primanoff Gold, which has, Will's a fabric guy, I'm not, but basically he should, tell me if I'm wrong mate, but basically it should be the highest warmth to weight ratio that you can get for a synthetic insulation. Yeah. So any higher than that, you're looking it down. So what it means is if you get wet, or when or if this gets wet then it still keeps you warm so some of the features on the the uh thermal insulated tarp system tits is um that it can be modified for for use in lots of different environments so you can wear it like this is like a poncho um type uh type of sort of rig so we've got arm sleeves in it uh, um sleeves in it you can in this instance we was wearing his helmet so we can demonstrate it's actually going over the helmet so, you know, you can properly get in amongst it. Equally, you can use it as a sleeping bag. Um, so it's a rectangular shape when it's all put together. Um, you can zip it up and use it as an emergency sleeping bag system. You could get a couple of people in there if you needed to. The other thing that you can do is you can use it as a liner for your basher or for your poncho. So we've had uh, guys using this out in Norway. Uh, we've used it in Norway as well. And when we're using it as a thermal insulator to a tarp system, we're raising the temperature up to about zero degrees, which when we were using it, it was about minus 20. It was raising the internal temperature of the um, snow hole that we were in up to about 20 degrees. Not snow hole, but um, that's what I'm looking for. Slit uh, in the ground. So, um, so yeah, that's it. Well, I mean, Will, what does it feel like? How, how easy is it to put on, mate? Yeah, super easy, pretty, uh, it's packable as well. And yeah, just really easy to, to wear as a poncho. Yeah, we spent quite a lot of time working on the zips on it, so you don't get any snagging with the zips, obviously. That's one of the major problems that you see with a lot of sort of low-end equipment, is that you need to get out of it in a rush, and you can, because the zips, two-way zips, means that they're opening nice and smooth, you get in and out really quickly. It's a really good piece of kit if you're wanting, or if you know that you're gonna be moving through um, through the ground, and you just need to get some insulation on, but then you need to pack it away really quickly. Really ideal for that.